investigating. Take a look at these My Report photos from South Metro Fire Rescue. You can see the intensity as flames engulf a house in Parker this morning. And 7 News discovering a dangerous situation for firefighters sent in to battle that fire. 7 News reporter Molly Hendrickson asking questions outside what's left of the home. And Molly, at one point, those firefighters had to evacuate. They did. They went into the basement and they had to evacuate out of it. It was later revealed that in the basement there was a grow operation. Now, investigators aren't confirming that. They're only saying that they're still investigating. You can see the South Metro Investigations Unit just pulling away. Now, it took crews about an hour and a half to knock this thing down and get inside. When they did, they made that unusual discovery. The 911 call came from inside this home shortly after 4 a.m. The fire burning so intensely in the basement, it even forced firefighters out. They would later find out why. He has the entire perimeter of the basement framed in for grow operation. Well, I'm shocked. I had no idea. I would have liked to have known. Investigators are not confirming it, but 7 News has learned the man who lives here, Sam Carducci, had his grower's license and may have been growing marijuana here in his basement. His website, growyourmeds.com, confirms he's been growing for more than a year and promises low prices. That would be a shock. Yeah, I had no idea. We checked. Carducci has several business licenses, but not a single one is up to date. It's unclear whether his grower's license was. And we spoke with two women who tell us they were relatives of Carducci and living here with him. They say that they knew nothing and still know nothing about a grow operation in the basement. Reporting live, Molly Hendrickson, 7 News.